a needle to cure disease, a cupping to clear the cold, a section of moxa for stimulating blood, a bowl of Chinese medicine passed down for thousands of years, I'm Peter McCoy, and I have lived in Tianjin for the last 28 years. I've used Chinese medicine many times. The development of Chinese medicine has a history of thousands of years. In China, choosing Chinese medicine for medical treatment has long been a tradition of Chinese people. These seemingly miraculous and ancient treatment methods have also played a big role in the response to COVID-19. Today, I will embark on a journey, searching to find the secret behind China's successful response to COVID-19. Tianjin University of Traditional Chinese Medicine. There is a medicine mountain with more than 300 Chinese medicinal plants. I heard there are some plants on this medicine mountain that can be used to treat COVID-19. How can a leaf treat COVID-19? Maybe the TCM expert I'm going to find can give me the answer. According to traditional Chinese medicine, COVID-19 belongs in category of damp virus disease. There are many kinds of Chinese herbs can treat this kind of disease. Ah. For example, Borgoni, Cusbidadi, Rhizoma, and Radix. This root has a heat clearing and a detoxifying effect. Oh, that's interesting. Where did you learn this? This is Chinese medicine learned it over a thousand years. Now by using modern technology, we found light. Polydietans contained in Borgoni, Cusbidadi, Rhizoma, and Radix has the strongest killing and depressing effect on COVID-19. Only one plant can treat COVID-19? Of course not. It's a combination of a dozen herbs. In formula, we call Xuanfei Bai Dufang. Xuanfei Bai Dufang? Who created it? It's created by the team headed by uh, academic Zhang Boli. He is the real hero in our hearts. <laughs> In order to fight the COVID-19, China has temporarily built a makeshift hospital in Wuhan. With the help of integrated Chinese and Western medicine treatment, none of the 564 mild and ordinary patients admitted to the hospital have become severely ill. The Suanfei Baidu prescription used in the treatment process is a classic Chinese medicine prescription developed based on clinical diagnosis and scientific analysis. Chang 就达到了化学清除、药效物质清除、结构质量稳定可控，符合现代医药研究的一般原理。The question is which Chinese medicine component has an inhibitory effect on the virus, and how is modern Chinese medicine developed? The lab in front of me might have the answer. Each medicinal herb contains different chemical components, and the combination of different chemical components constitutes the medicine. The TCM Components Bank saves the molecular structure of these components in a computer in digital form. 
when a new virus appears, we use the computer's huge database to analyze and find the key target of virus replication. Through molecular docking technology, the chemical structure of traditional Chinese medicine components can be matched with the key targets of viral proteins to determine the effective components that inhibit virus reproduction. After verification by various in vivo and in vitro experiments, new antiviral drugs can finally be quickly formed. The Modern Chinese medicine culture, represented by the TCM Components Bank, has become an important part of the treatment of COVID-19. In China, 92% of confirmed COVID-19 patients have received TCM treatment. 你好,我想了解一下你当时住院的情况。当时我们在帮他医院的时候,我们从大概就有五百多人吧。通过中药的治疗,都起到很大的变化,有明显的好转。相信我们国家的中医是有办法把我们病治好的。我们有信心。N